Well, uh, hello. <clears throat> Welcome to the second pat. Uh, in this pat, we will be impl in implementing uh, economical industrial stuff. Because, well, I have really got nothing more to really do. Hmm. Ah, stability. Yes, I'm gaining 10 stability, which is quite useful when your uh, stability is pretty much dead. Okay, mm so bracket shooting. Hmm, okay, so, no, <clears throat> yeah, I want the war industrialist. Okay, so so point four. <clears throat> yeah, I need at least. Hopefully, I could get like I don't know. Fifty percent. Yeah, fifty percent. That's what I need to aim for. Hmm. Well. Hmm. <clears throat> okay, so continue that. Okay, so. Oil research fund. Hmm. <clears throat> Spend the power grid. Interesting. So yeah, I am currently just uh, doing some pretty interesting details of what to get. So we have communism in Arkansas, fascism there, non-aligned, ah, the Confederacy of Georgia. I want to see a uh, oh. Oh that that that's kind of a bit annoying. Uh well at least that's got Georgia. <laughs> but uh, I don't think that's really much. Yeah, Georgia really isn't gonna be able to help me as much as I'm sure they would be. Though if I saw a confederacy of Tennessee, that'd be lovely. <clears throat> no, it seems to be non-aligned. <clears throat> hmm. 
Ah oh, yes, ah, here's a little thing. By the way, an interesting fact is that I technically have a polling ball mod, and uh, so yeah. You may see some of those. Like in Kansas. Though, uh, it looks like, um, who's winning this war? <laughs> Seems like nobody is, but, eh, okay. <clears throat> okay, so California is 3 to 22. I've got 34. <clears throat> I just don't have any uh, manpower. Because as it turns out... Ah. And it, it just got very dark in the room. That's why you heard the sound of a light. But, hmm, okay. That's something to get. <clears throat> Minutemen Militia. Stats of, okay, yeah. Okay, computing machines. <laughs> hmm. So, do I get that? Yeah, ooh. That'll be useful. I need more political power. And then I need conscription. Limited conscription. Which requires more than 10% war support, which is slightly annoying. Uh. Well, that, that, okay, so, I won't be able to use up my political power, I'm, I'll have to use that doing something else. <clears throat> right, I can do this, get that, do this. New Orleans Alliance, Third River War, Unite these lot. <clears throat> Unite you know, Arkansas and Mississippi, Alabama, Georgia, Tennessee, and then South Carolina. <clears throat> so, okay, that'll be crushed. So I need to do this, really. Because uh, war support is the only thing that's really being a nuisance for me at the moment. <clears throat> Though the political power that this gives should, uh... Hmm. Well, it's just partially annoying. Oh! Yes, I'm getting a surplus of manpower. Very nice. It's only... 10, 11,000 though, which is not much in the grand scheme of wanting a million or two million men to be fielded. So that is a bit annoying. And uh, that's going to be a really big problem. A really big problem. <clears throat> Okay, so this focus here should do it. Political power gain or... Hmm. 
I get a lot of focuses, though, that give me political power. So I think I'm going to go for War Industrialist, because I'll get Funding Campaign, which gets gives me political power, and I'll get these industries and oil takeover, develop Dallas, develop Houston, selling Texas bonds. I love how I get to uh, fly the battle flag. That's nice. <laughs> uh, I, I know exactly what it means by battle flag. Hmm, real nice. Although I don't think it would be necessary. I think they originally did it to distinguish themselves. And I think the Texas flag is quite distinguishable. But, eh, probably has a symbolic value. Okay, here. Okay, there. And then up here. There. Two hundred and fifty six days. Okay. Bootlegs have been a problem in Texas since. Prohibition. While many officials have turned a blind eye in exchange for some back scratching, Evans has decided not to giving that a hot speech over the Texas Airways. Evans has promised to use the army to wage war on the bootlegging scum. Texas troops have been sent all over the state to break up speakeasies and to crush bootleggers. Evans has given secret orders to compensate all money funds from bootleggers to the claim for future campaigns. Ah, so basically just, you know, crushing criminals. Totally. That, that totally is what that is. <laughs> then a Protestant Texas. That'll be interesting. So, it looks like uh, I'll be crushing bootleggers. So that'll be interesting. Very, very, very interesting. Hmm. So, yeah. I don't have anybody that kind of gives me army experience. So I'm going to have to gather that by conquest, basically. But thankfully, I just have the right amount to do my one thing that I need to do. <clears throat> okay, so three men. Okay, so automatic cannon adapted from a fast firing anti air gun list. Automatic cannon can lay down on a hail of fire that is devastating to soft targets. The small caliber does limit its anti personnel, anti armor performance. Okay, so a small and cheap cannon able to fire both anti infantry and anti armor rounds. Its small caliber limits its usefulness. Well, that's good enough. Uh, let's see. Radios. Absolutely. I will be getting radios. Oh, and, uh, definitely smoke. Okay. One day I will have tanks. One day, very, very soon, hopefully. In some way. I shall have tanks, and it'll be great. I'm going to go for land doctrine cost decrease stickers. 
I mean, I don't really have much to lose by not doing that because, well, I haven't really got much interesting stuff to do. So, a Protestant Texas. President Evans has made it clear to that clear that he wants to make sure Texans stay Protestant. As such, he signed an executive order making it illegal for a non-Protestant to hold office in Texas. He has also consul 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 um, consul like conversed the state legislature to make an official dedication dedication of the Pope. Only a few Democrats have come to oppose. Only a few Democrats have come to oppose. Let's see what does it Come to oppose events on religious freedom grounds, while well, others say they think it's common sense and mostly, and mostly, uh, and mostly Republic of Texas. What? Ah, mostly. I am assuming mostly common sense. Most in. It's saying that it's common sense in mostly Protestant Texas. Ah, uh, well, I like um reading the descriptions for mods. At least the focus trees stick as well. They're always interesting. Ah, uh, I see what that focus is. <laughs> oh, that's interesting. Okay, so at least I'm getting stability. I may not be getting very close, but I will get extraordinarily close. Yep, so, okay, rocky tree development. Well, my, my output's about to increase. Hmm, interesting. Okay, so stability will be increased. Deal with big business. Deal with print, deal with police. Hmm. <coughs> Obtain advanced European weapons, cavalry tradition, uh, mechanized blitzkrieg land doctrine. Hmm. So what can I do? I think I'll get naval bombers because uh, eventually I'm not I don't think I'm gonna have large amounts of naval power okay. Perhaps Okay, so Protestant Texas, um, let's see, what to do, okay, I think I need this extra amount of political power, but, ah, no, no, 
I need to deal with this problem. Because this, this um, crime wave thing is kind of being annoying. The client has had a decent relationship with local police. However, many police are distrustful of the sorts like, like Clint Evans has decided, like the clan. Evans has decided that he will allow police a free hand in running local townships if they will seek and destroy the band dens in East Texas. The crime spree that ma there must be stopped if Texas is to become a true Anglo-Christian nation. Many sheriffs have jumped on the chance. Okay, wait, let's see. Insurance have jumped at the chance to receive more funding and weapons from Austin's Ku Klux government. Ah, well. So, they're gonna, like, ah, yay. Hmm. There's already declared war on Little Dixie. Hmm, what is that? An interesting war. Oh, I see. Do you want volunteers by any chance? Mm-hmm. Okay, so... John... Tom Walker is that? So, let's see. I am going to see if I can gain military experience in warfare here, as long as they outlast and outlive them. Come on, just make it easy. Let me grind myself with some sweet, sweet experience and knowledge of warfare. Be real nice. Come on, come on, come on. Let's see. 17th of February. Ah, yes. Yes. Come on. 13th. 10th, 11th. Okay, it's 13th. It's the 13th. I'm hoping to gain army experience through a proxy war. Yes. Perfect. Perfect. We rapidly and quickly developing tactics. To make it more efficient. Come on, you lot. Ah. Ah, I didn't get to use that time there much. That's unfortunate. So I'm going to gain some experience in how to employ an army. Mm-hmm. Well, I think I'm going to go for a medium tank. Excavation, hmm. Well, that was disappointing. Okay, so I'm taking over the fuel. Oh, and I'm developing the cities, I see. Hmm. Twenty. Now, this is what I that's oh the District of Columbia versus Maryland. 
I will be amazed if the district wins that. Surely they can't. Like, that would just be mind-blowingly unbelievable. But so... Shit, militias. Ah, uh, let's go with... Deal with big business. Okay, so... Let's see, what does this read? Businesses like in most American, in most of America, have much influence. Jones has decided to reach out to them in hopes that he can use them to pressure legislation to enact his claim policies. Evans has promised to undo many of Eldred's and Ferguson's reforms in exchange for support. Going forward, one can expect more legislation to decide with the wizard president. Ah, uh, hmm. So basically, he's just trying to get more influence. Interesting. Okay. There is no way. At least, there should be absolutely no way that Hoover wins this. I will be astounded. Like, you would have to be so badly. Like, just like, unbelievably dumb to somehow lose. Hmm, okay, yeah, then I increase, then I get plates. I see, hmm. That's what that is. Oh, what the? How did they take Baltimore? This will be the first time I've ever seen the district win. And I'm extraordinarily astounded that the district won. It should not be possible. They don't have enough industrial territory to actually do that. Like, what? If they manage to somehow even, it, even take New England, I'll be amazed. However, if they win this, they'll, they'll gain an industry worthy of their uh, time. Uh, what are they up to? What are you up to? They have three to eight. Two to five. They have two to five. How? Seriously, how? Okay, they, Florida has one to eight. But uh, let's see, what's in Florida's tree? Democracy win? Ah, yes. Or this. <laughs> I am astounded by how easily they're winning. Like, they're really mopping the floor with them. Hmm, I'm gonna increase my conscription rate, I think. Because that'll be extraordinarily useful. Okay, a decimal radar, I think that is called. Dismetric radar. Okay. Well, the training time can be somewhat justified anyway, so continue. I am going to continue the oil. I'm continuing oil investments. I'm doing that. Then I need to secure oil exports, I suppose.
Hmm, yeah, I need more men to serve in the army. Because, uh, this is taking a lot of time, as it turns out, to get a good army. Or even just enough people to serve in the army. Ah, here we go. Now, it's not mandatory service yet, but... I mean, better than, uh, nothing. At least I get enough people to actually be able to fight. Hmm. Now, yeah, what's the Republic of Nevada up to? Okay, the Federal Republic of North Dakota is winning. Yeah, if they do, if they do seize the means of production, then, uh, hmm, they make themselves stand out rather interestingly. Ontarian Army. Hmm. Ah, just as I thought. They aren't able to hold the line enough. And it looks like the only areas they own are around Greater DC, the District of Columbia, and Baltimore. Hmm, interesting. Though I still need to keep an eye on that, because if they win, uh, that'll be an interesting problem. At least for me it will. Mmm, I see. Interesting. If I went for Lyndon B. Johnson, uh, that would be very interesting. I'm going the very opposite of him, granted. Okay, let's see. What's the description for this? In order to see a clan Texas, we must end the influence of liberal Hollywood movies who de demonized President Evans has signed a bill that will create a safe movie council which will regulate what movies can be shown in Texas theaters. Many theaters in Texas have found it much easier to play best of nation on loop for audiences on advice from local in layers in order to avoid a crackdown by the... And I'm gonna guess it's... Authorities or something. To avoid a crackdown by the government. Well, I was correct. <laughs> I was indeed correct. Okay, they could not afford an encirclement. Yet the district just got encircled. Badly. I knew it. There is no way the District of Columbia can win that. Seriously. It is pretty hard for them to win just because it's like they don't have the industrial capacity to wage a war unlike Pennsylvania or something so it's like here yeah, now nah, they're not going to be able to do that ooh maybe they do have a use a very specific use though hmm okay 86 I want enough men to be able to be useful. Hmm. Okay, Illinois, what are you up to? Okay, so he's got militia, racketeering gone wild. Pff, well, ain't that a problem they're dealing with? Okay, what are they up to? Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. 
sees Detroit, the mob takes control, Mafia rule, sees the Great Lakes, open another front to invade Ontario, Ontario is ours. Okay. Well, I may, I may just play Ohio one day. Just to see what their focus tree is like. Hmm. Oh, a continent-wide funding campaign. That's what that is. Ah. Hmm. Hmm. Interesting. Okay, so, yeah, if I'd picked Ellerid or Lyndon B. Johnson, uh, be more progressive, I suppose. Oil Research Fund would be next, I think, because, uh, I'm kind of having to divide up, uh, time between these things, so let's see. Excavation 2. Oil processing. I think I just remembered. This is what I need. This is absolutely what I need. Okay. The focus breath of a nation has been completed. So that is very interesting. So let's see. Okay. Hmm. Well, rebels. Hmm. Yes. I think I'll make an alliance with. Uh, well, it was more of an economic liberal. He has always been friendly in LA and member of the This is a visit to this visit to Mississippi would do us well in getting in in LA against Louisiana. After all, we must keep the color line in place. Hmm, interesting. Ah, oh, that's a very interesting thing. So I've got an ally to finally get. In fact, that'll be a very useful ally. However, before I go to war with them, I think I will... Ooh, the New England Hurricane! Wow! They must have gotten blasted by one. Eh. Okay. Once I can get Louisiana... It'll be very nice to finally get them, so yeah, I need Arkansas because, well, they'll be a nice distraction to both Louisiana and Oklahoma. Okay, well, that's interesting.
Okay, so... All I need to really do for Louisiana is put as much pressure as absolutely possible on them. Hmm. So yeah, so it seems. Oh, well, okay, basic medium tank. I just realized that I can now do. <clears throat> okay, heavy armament, armament, okay, can't destroy it, okay, so then, improved radio, Along with flip armor and smoke launches. Well, time to get very busy when it comes to tank creation. Because my tank cores will not be designed to be really alone. Okay, so what do we have here? Okay, so I've got an alliance. Now I just need to get that extra factory. Hmm. Okay. Uh, naval refit yards. I'm going to go for trade interdiction, I think. Just because I don't think I'm really going to have a huge fleet. So it would be very nice to not have to worry so much. In fact, if I just get this. And did that. May never be the best, but it certainly will be a lot better than nothing. Because one day I'm going to need a large submarine fleet. To do some really boring stuff. And then, so what else do I go for? After, after this, I'm going to go for taking over, or rather, the funding thing, just because that'll increase the amount I can do.
hopefully by the end of this I will have an industry very large industry so let me see what do I get so I get this which means that I can eventually possibly do this 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 and this along with this hmm but so yeah Hmm. So far, it seems like I'm doing well. So let's see, what do we have here? Okay, integrate into the force. Green army, a modern army. Rangerless weapons. Hmm. So that'll be an interesting thing to uh, get to eventually. Well, I think it is time to do this, which, well, this is just what's in the name. Oh, okay, Florida's doing interesting stuff. Let's see. Let's see. Oil processing, rubber processing, which will become very important. Mm, and uh, I think I'm gonna go for, let's see. Oof, oof, ooh, well, uh, smoke screen, I think. Or rather, smoke grenades, but it allows for a smoke screen. But so yeah, I hope you liked this video, because it was rather enjoyable to make. Ah, uh, see you.